All parties in the matter of Brooks versus James. Step forward. Keithisha Brooks is suing seamstress Jeannie James for the return of money she paid for bridesmaid dresses and for ruining her wedding. Miss Brooks, you were getting married and hired the defendant to do some bridesmaids dresses for you. Yes, Your Honor. How many bridesmaids dresses was she making? Ten. And what was the total cost that she quoted you to make the ten dresses? A thousand dollars. So, hundred bucks a dress. How much did you pay her? I gave her the five hundred dollar deposit and I had told the girls I already paid the deposit so she can buy the things for it. And they was and don't, don't give me a whole story. I'm old, I like to keep it simple. <laughs> the dresses were $1,000. You gave her a $500 deposit. Did you pay her any other money? I gave her 100 for the flower girl's dresses and $80 for the boy's vest. Just a second. Okay, let's go back to my first question. How much was her entire bill? She was making 10 dresses, that's what you said, at $100 a dress. And for that, you gave her $500? Yes, ma'am. So you still owed her another $500? Yes, ma'am. Then you asked her to make a flower girl's dress? Yes, ma'am. And some vests for the boys? Yes, ma'am. That's fine. At $180? Yes, ma'am. Did she make those? She did make those. And did you use the yes, flower did. girl's dress and the boys' vests? Yes. Did you ever give her any other money towards the bridesmaid's dresses? Just the $500. Okay. And you're dissatisfied and you want $3,200 back from her, I don't know, because of punitive damages. Did the wedding take place as scheduled? Yes, ma'am. And did 10 bridesmaids show up? Yes, ma'am. Did 10 bridesmaids wear those dresses? Yes, ma'am. And you have pictures of them? Yes, ma'am. That you want to show me? Yes, ma'am. I'll see it. So let me understand this. Right now, you got 10 bridesmaids dresses that were used by the bridesmaids that you paid $50 a piece for. Yes. Well, I see two flower girls. Yes. Did she make both flower girls dresses? She made both flower girls dresses. Are the purple dresses the dresses she made? Yes, ma'am. So what's the problem? Because every last one of them had something wrong with them where we right. had to put pins, stitch a tape, one dress we had to, the coordinator, he had to make a halter just for her to fit because the dress didn't fit at all. So, you used them, they can't tell from the video, they look fine. You paid 50 bucks a piece for them. I mean, she has a counterclaim. She says you owe her $240. Actually, she owes you 500 But you wouldn't have brought the counterclaim, I assume, if she hadn't sued you. Yes, ma'am. Correct? Yes, ma'am. You're not getting any money. You use the dresses and then throw them away. That's what... Most people do with bridesmaids' dresses. You got lucky. You got to pay only 50 bucks a piece instead of 100. And they still look pretty reasonable in the pictures, which is actually all you need for your wedding is the pictures. I don't know what you're complaining about. You want to tell me? Yes, ma'am. Because in the first place, when I went to her, because she's supposed to be making the dresses for me, and I gave her the $500 in January, and I had gave her 60 for my reception dress, which she never made that reception dress. And the whole time, like I told the girls, they were going to give her the $50 when they got the dress. And the whole time, she never, like, said she had any problems with the dress or anything. She never said she had an issue. Every time I text her to ask her, how's everything going? It's going good. Close to the week of the wedding, they didn't even get the dresses till about 2 o'clock in the morning, 3 o'clock in the morning. Well, not a day before, a week before. Have you been a dressmaker forever? 45 years. Anything special happened with these dresses? Fabric and body types, we had to adjust. There were fittings. There were more than one fitting. How many times did the bridesmaids come to the house? Depending on what the issue was with the dress, all of them came at least twice, some three times. Miss Brooks, I can't help you. I don't know what you're suing her for. You paid her $500 for 10 dresses. You used the 10 dresses. And I hope you, are you the husband? I was the wedding coordinator. Oh, good. Well, I assume you're happily married? Yes. That's all that you care about. Oh. What else is there? Did your dress fit? My, I never, my no, wedding dress did. did your work. wedding dress, did yeah. your wedding dress fit? Yes. That's all anybody cares about. Your wedding dress fits. Did you have it made by somebody else or did you buy it? No, I had bought it a year ago. And did you put it in a box when you finished with it? No, I still have it in the bag. In the, in the same bag? Because you're never going to wear it again, right? You wear it once, but you're going to keep it. Right. Most people take their bridesmaids dresses, they donate them to Goodwill. You were lucky, you got to pay half. I don't see that you have a case, Ms. Brooks. You used the dresses. We're done. Thank you.